All right, so the REN protocol team has announced that you can use the REN bridge now. Um, this is super exciting just because it means that I can mint some REN Bitcoin. So I'm gonna be brave and try it right now. Uh, what I did is I went to bridge.renproject.io. Then I connected my MetaMask wallet. <clears throat> I had to sign another two transactions uh, just to connect my three box. And then I ended up on this screen. So I put in how much Bitcoin I'm gonna start with. And then you'll notice that if you wanted to do this with Zcash or Bitcoin Cash, you can do that as well. Um, you can create an ERC20 token for REN Zcash or REN Bitcoin Cash. Uh, and then you notice here that this is the wallet, like my Ethereum wallet where the REN Bitcoin will, sh will end up being received. And then here's how much I'll receive from this. This is less some of the fees that I'm gonna incur uh, so if I click next, I can see the breakdown of those fees. They're, they're I think, arguably small. Uh, so I've got a, a REN VM fee here and then your standard Bitcoin network fee. So something that you have to pay for no matter what. Uh, what I like is that I don't have to back calculate like how much I need to add in terms of fees to get the transaction to go through. It just deducts it <clears throat> from the total Bitcoin that I'm starting with. So I'm gonna hit confirm. And there we go. So <clears throat> this is where I'm going to send my Bitcoin to. Uh, you'll also notice that uh, I am able to delete this and start over with another transfer. So if you feel like the total um, needs to be changed, you can just click on the little widget here. Uh, and then notice here's the REN VM network fees. So it's 0.1% plus this smaller 0 0.00035 Bitcoin. And that's it. So I'll be back to see uh, what happens after I deposit my Bitcoin. All right, so I'm back after six block confirmations. So uh, the first part of my converting uh, my Bitcoin to REN Bitcoin, I guess, is taken care of. And I don't know, this is the first time I've done this. So I'm just gonna go ahead and click the Submit to Ethereum button. All right, and let me reshare my screen so you can see the, uh, the pop-up here. All right, so I've got my, my MetaMask window and looks like I'm gonna pay $1.61 in gas. And I'm just gonna double check what the gas prices are. So I'm just checking this on my phone. And it looks like, <laughs> it looks, gas is still expensive. So I'm gonna spend 29 guay, put the gas price at 29 guay. And let's go ahead and hit confirm. All right, so I've got my transaction hash. Let's see what that looks like. Cool. So I'll be back in just a bit to see whenever this settles. All right, so that's it. I uh, got my, my REN BTC. I've got 0 0.009 REN BTC, which is about $100 worth. Uh, but I'm just super excited. This was so easy to use. And I just, again, I just followed the instructions on bridge.renproject.io. And uh, you'll notice that, so after I did my initial Bitcoin deposit, uh, I then had to click that button, submit to Ethereum, and then this was the final screen that I saw. So I've, I've checked my, my wallet, I've checked the Ethereum uh, transaction hash, and I've, I can see here I've got it. So anyways, just uh, you know, big congrats to the REN team, and I am so excited to see more Bitcoin come on chain with Ethereum, and uh, you should be too. Once you get that, you can do all sorts of interesting things already. Like you can go trade it on Uniswap or one inch exchange. Uh, but I expect there to be lots coming in the coming weeks. And uh, I wouldn't be surprised if the uh, WBTC.cafe goes to mainnet really soon. So uh, let me know if you have any questions on Twitter and uh, good luck. And uh, one last thing, of course, be careful. Uh, this is all new. There's, you know, there's never a guarantee that there won't be any sort of smart contract bug. Uh, 
they've gone through audits, but again, there's no guarantee. So, uh, you know, when you put your money into this, there's always a chance that there could be some unforeseen risk there. So uh, anyways, be safe.